Most golf courses get a handful of holes in one per season. Getting two in a day is pretty much unheard of. But what happened this week at Minneapolis Golf Club goes way beyond all of that. Ren Clayton explains how this likely first of its kind golf story unfolded. A smooth swinging Saturday for 13 year old Preston Miller warming up for a lesson. Calm compared to a couple days ago. I was jumping up and down, yelling. It was my first hole in one ever. Thursday night at Minneapolis Golf Club will go down in the history of the sport, not because of the shot, but everything that happened next. Triggered by Preston making the bold decision to continue playing the same ball. This golf course, you can't really lose many balls. I wasn't thinking of losing the ball at all. But here's where the story gets crazy. Preston went on to lose that hole in one ball. It was later found by a member who picked it up and made an ace here on hole 16, his fourth career hole in one. It's the craziest thing I've ever heard. Minneapolis head golf professional Dan Simpson says about 40 golfers came through before Ricardo Fernandez found the famous ball, then teed it up on 16. Two hole in ones, one day by two different people. I can't, can't imagine it, it's ever happened before. A key part of this, the ball had a St. Louis Park logo, making it unmistakably Preston's, who was enjoying a free root beer when he found out what happened. Ricardo walked in and he's like, is this one of your guys' balls? I was like, yeah. He said, I just hit a hole in one with it. And I'm like, there's no way because I also did that and lost the ball. We went to the now famous spot where the ball was lost then discovered. Is there going to be a plaque here then? <laughs> well, the, the, the club is already talking about where should we put this golf ball? I mean, this should be in the, in the club part of our history. So if Preston's willing to give it up, uh, we're going to display it in the clubhouse um, or, or get a duplicate ball. For now, Preston's got it in his room, the ball that wanted to be found. Golf gives us great stories, and this is, this is another one. At Minneapolis Golf Club, Ren Clayton, WCCO4 News. Yeah, they needed like a plaque for the clubhouse or something at least. Preston is just a seventh grader, by the way, but he plays on the St. Louis Park High School varsity golf team. He says he lipped out a putt Thursday on the 18th hole to card an eight over par round. Such a cool story and good job, Ren.